everybody, it's Trish here. It's been a really long time since I've done a video and um, I have some good reasons for that. So let me just get life out of the way real quick. Um, in life, I was traveling, then I got COVID and then I was traveling again. So I have just gotten home this past week and um, all of a sudden it's birthday week. And so I wanted to just do a quick video to share with you all the stuff that came in the mail for me and the gifts that friends gave me and some of which are YouTube people that we all know and love. Um, and so without further ado, there's my spread. That pillow right there was not for birthday. Andrew made me that when I had breast cancer. It just happens to be sitting in the camera view. But I'm going to move over and show you all the goodies I got. Okay, let's see if I can turn this thing around. I'm just going to start from left to right. I had so many goodies come to me for my birthday that I literally just made box bouquets out of them because if I went through every single thing that I got, we would be here all day. So I'm just going to quickly show you to start with this beautiful bouquet of flowers from one of my best friends here. Her name is Cindy. I love you, Cindy. And she sent me, she's laid up with her son broke his femur. So he's at home being taken care of by her and she had surgery on her wrist. So they're both laid up at home, but she was sweet enough to send flowers. She didn't have to do that. That was really sweet. The first box that I got in the mail was from, I'll start with the first one. This is from Carol, from So Carol. And look at this haul. There's a few things I wanna really show you. One is she found jam called Trish's Jam. Isn't that cool? And I can have it with my scone mix. I'm gonna make clotted cream. Here's the recipe to go with those scones. She gave me this really pretty necklace. I love it. A really pretty sun catcher with my favorite bird on it. This magazine is a Dorset, the town that she lives in, and it's got um, all kind of her favorite walking paths in there, and that's really nice book. I'm enjoying looking at that. These donkey coasters are too cute. They look just like my donkeys. And of course, she always sends me some cookies, and we're trying some new ones this time. These are lemon ginger and butter crunch. Pretty box. But she really spoiled me. I, there might even be more stuff down in there that I have not yet, that I didn't quite get in the box bouquet. But that was from Carol from, from Carol from So Carol. Thank you, Carol. You have me pegged, and I love everything in this box. You know I love the cookies. You know I love any kind of food. And, of course, anything that has something to do with some of my farm animals is always special to me. So thank you so much to you and Chris. The next box that I got was this gorgeous box from Andra from Andra Makes. Look at all the goodies in here. The first thing I unwrapped was these metallic markers and this pad, writing pad. And um, Andra, I've been thinking about getting metallic markers and I just had not broken down and done it because I just didn't wanna buy more markers. You know, I have a lot. and But I've been wanting these metallic ones for a long time, so thank you. And then she sent me this really sweet card. Probably my favorite gift for my birthday that I've gotten so far is this little hanging pillow that Andra made. And it's for the dressing room. And look on the back, if I can turn it around, it says, Hand, Handmade in Tennessee. And that's one of Andra's tags. And I just love this with the pom-poms. You may recall I did a video where I took a bedroom and turned it into a huge, beautiful closet and dressing room. And so this is gonna hang on the doorknob or on the rack in my dressing room. I think that's my favorite gift of all. Andrew, thank you so much. That was so thoughtful and sweet of you and just the colors, everything about it is perfection, just like you. Okay, she also sent me some nice goat milk hand cream, lip balm and soap that smells amazing. I love this cup that says, I may look like I'm listening to you, but in my head, I'm thinking about goats. And it, truer words were never spoken. That is the cutest cup. It arrived without being broken or chipped or anything. And then look at this little pin. It has a daisy with glitter in it. It's a little pom-pom pin. 
And let me see if I can turn this around and show you that it matches my hair. It does. It completely is the exact same color as my hair. So, Andra, thank you so much. Your card was so sweet. Your gift is so sweet. You nailed it. You made my day. And um, this thing, though, this gets the prize. That thing is precious. I love it. The next thing I got in the mail was this box from my BFF. I have a couple of BFFs, but this is my longest probably my oldest and dearest friend. We've known each other for probably 40 years and she sends me all kinds of stuff all the time. But um, this was a box from her and look at this cute little pig in a car. This is a bath bomb. Let me see if I can set this up. This is a, oh, come on little piggy, stay in there. This is a bath bomb and it's a little piggy riding in a car, in a little pineapple car. Isn't that the cutest? It smells amazing. Kind of got on my fingers, but it'll come right off. She sent me this little collie. We both had collies. And um, she sent me this little bag that's made in the mountains with collie. And it's got some lip balm and, and some other stuff from Lush that smells really good. A soap. And then I love this. This is... And believe it or not, an Amazon gift card. And isn't it cute? It rolls. My grandson's going to have a ball with that. Inside of it is Amazon gift card. And when you open up the back and pull the gift card out, the wheels go, zzz, they spin. It's really cute. And then she got me the Unicorn Dream Snack Mix. I can't wait to put this in a bowl and pick at it while I'm sewing. That looks delicious. So, my sweet friend always thinks of me on my birthday, of course, because we've been friends for 40 years, and I won't let her forget when my birthday is. <laughs> um, and then from my other friend that lives in the same um, town in North Carolina, she sent me a really sweet card, and money fell out of it. So I spent that money on a, my dinner date last night. Okay, probably the next and last thing I received when I got home from my dinner date last night was this gorgeous bunch of food from Jen from Today in Jen's Sewing Room. You all know her as my sewing BFF. She is so thoughtful and she knows that I love macarons and she ordered me this huge container of delicious macarons. Chocolate, vanilla, raspberry, lemon, salted caramel, and pistachio. Do you think I can eat all those? I think I can put a pretty big dent in that. And she sent me also this blueberry lemon cake and you can see there's a big chunk taken out of it because that was my breakfast this morning and it was delicious. I put it in the air fryer for a minute with some butter. It was amazing. So that is basically all of my birthday stuff from friends. I also got a ton of well wishes from so many wonderful people like my dear friend Adam from Adam Sews. He's so precious. I love Adam and he sent me a really sweet birthday message. And um, so many people just have reached out to me. I'm just in shock, really. I'm in awe of how many people just reached out and remembered my birthday. And I'm thankful for every one of you. I, The friendship is the most precious part about it, more precious than any gift. And um, I just love and appreciate every one of my beautiful friends. And I treasure your friendship. The gifts are fun but they're nothing compared to you. Um, so, on that note, friends, let's talk about sewing. I have not done any sewing. Um, because I was out of town and because I had COVID, I just haven't gotten to any sewing, but I have a room full of fabric here that I, a lot of which I purchased on my trip to Atlanta with my BFF Jen. And, um, I am anxious to get sewing again. I really want to get back in the groove. I'm going to crank the AC up here. I'm going to get my macarons out and get in my belly with those things. And um, it's going to be fun. I'm really ready to sew a little summer dress. And I've got some ideas in mind. I've got some new fabric I want to use. I also got a ton of well wishes from so many wonderful people, like my dear friend Adam from Adam Sews. He's so precious. I love Adam, and he sent me a really sweet birthday message. And um, 
so many people just have reached out to me. I'm just in shock, really. I'm in awe of how many people just reached out and remembered my birthday. And I'm thankful for every one of you. I, The friendship is the most precious part about it. More precious than any gift. And um, I just love and appreciate every one of my beautiful friends. And I treasure your friendship. The gifts are fun but they're nothing compared to you. Um, so, on that note, friends, let's talk about sewing. I have not done any sewing um, because I was out of town and because I had COVID, I just haven't gotten to any sewing, but I have a room full of fabric here that I, a lot of which I purchased on my trip to Atlanta with my BFF Jen, and um, I am anxious to get sewing again. I really want to get back in the groove. I'm going to crank the AC up here. I'm going to get my macarons out and get in my belly with those things. And um, it's going to be fun. I'm really ready to sew a little summer dress. And I've got some ideas in mind. I've got some new fabric I want to use. And okay, I'm going to go put away all my gifts. Enjoy all this food. And I'll probably be big as a barn next time I see you with all these treats that I have to eat. But I'm going to enjoy every single one of them. And um, FYI, I went to my mammogram this morning and it all came back normal. Hallelujah. Goodbye, cancer. And so that's good news. And um, a lot of people ask me about how I'm doing. And so I'm doing great. All right. I'm going to let you go. I'll see you as soon as I've sewn something. Bye. Excuse me.